Misha, yeah. I'm, I'm now too much smiling already. What I want to see is, can you give us the look? Can you give it? You're saying this character's oh, got a, got a bit of a vibe to her. Can you give an example of a like the look that she's got? Well, that's pretty deadpan. I'll give you that. That's what, what's that? What do you call that? Is that the hundred yard stare or something? Is it? Thousand, thousand what, yard stare. You can stop now. I'll take you out. <laughs> I will. Trust me. And for what you said about my coat, I'll take you out again. I don't blame you, Misha. I don't blame you I think we need to all. calm down. We need to calm down. <laughs> Tell me a little bit, Misha, about... You've, you've filmed during lockdown, haven't you, with, with social distancing in place. So how does that work when you're working with other actors? It was tough. I mean, the thing... Well, for me, it was great because it meant that I had more time to get my part right. <laughs> so I had more time. But we had, a, we had someone walking around with a two-metre stick checking, you know, that we were in the, you know obviously uh, social distancing and it was I mean it was it was interesting but the, I have to say the whole cast they adapted so well the other thing which was interesting was watching you know uh, looking at someone through a perspex screen you know instead of you obviously don't see it <laughs> you know but there's a screen so if you're kissing someone you, you're kissing the screen essentially it was very clever how they did it it was brilliant Misha what was it like in terms of how you were welcomed on set because they are really, I, I can see from your face, you're going to say they're lovely, but they're really established. And you're coming yeah. in from the outside and, the, you oh, know, well, you cannot <laughs> mess up on EastEnders because it is so popular and people have had the break and they were looking forward to it coming back. Yeah. Well, the pressure for me when I first got in, and I describe it like wearing a nappy and um, having, you know, pampers and, and baby wipes. That's how I felt. Pardon? I was so, I was so afraid. <laughs> I was literally, I was terrified. But the thing was, you know, you're walking in our set with 30 years of experience. People have been on it for ages. And I literally was so welcomed by everyone. I got so much love that in the end, I was fine. But at first, I was terrified. Did they give you any tips? Oh, yeah. I got a lot of encouragement. You know, the thing was, it, the character, I really felt the character. I know that character. So it was very easy for me to be that character. But the thing was, because Steve McFadden, bless him, he's so giving as an actor, he was great. And so it made my job easier. And Diane as well, they were just brilliant. And we're all kind of like the same age. So it kind of works. We've met each other around the way, award shows and stuff. So it was nice. Who's the, uh, who's the giggler on the set? Is there someone, because I might, are you someone like who does that a bit? Do you, do you you're yes. doing one of your <laughs> stares and then you lose it, does that happen? <laughs> Yes, I'm very, I'm a joker. Really, I'm a joker. But when I pull the hard face, believe me, everyone's running. They're terrified. Um, who's how's she going around for dinner, Sunday dinner this week? I'm just trying to um, figure out if it's the person. I'm going to have to. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. <laughs> Thought I might have had you. But you do know I... that all the friends who've cooked for you in the past few months now know that you've done this to them. <laughs> Misha, no. it's all... <laughs> A great experience on the show, honestly, and the storyline is it gets more intense and she gets more hardcore on the show. Honestly, it's brilliant. I'm really excited. I, I mean, for me, the character was just great. I like how you brought that back to the message at the end there. You brought that back nicely. Misha, lovely to talk to you again. You take care. We didn't even talk about Misha's new album. Misha's got a new album out as well. It's called Gospel. Uh, that's all from us this morning. Back tomorrow at six o'clock. You can follow the usual BBC News outlets for the Health Secretary statement to the Commons about those new restrictions for Merseyside around 10.30 this morning. Bye-bye.